video we are going to show you Arduino Pixed in action uh, it's it supplied this uh, 5 volt power supply from a 5 volt charger USB charger and as I plug in it starts booting up so as it boots on the television that's attached to it you can see the uh, Raspberry Pi logo come coming in uh, let me describe what it is so essentially uh, Arduino Pix has is designed for Raspberry Pi Zero that you can see this and this is my Arduino Pix board it's populated on the both side of the PCB so the key feature is that uh, the pogo pins that you can see it's flexible and with these pins two for power supply and two for USB we connect it to the this test points um, you can see we have the screen coming up but we will test it but in the meantime we I wanted to show you how to assemble it if you know it's hub fixed or earlier product you know how it's assembled it takes the contact on these uh, test points that you can see here a pair of pins two for power supply and two for USB they take uh, make contact with this and then with this one we provide four screws that you can use just assemble it it comes pre-installed with this post that you can see and then the key feature is of course the three USB port I have connected a keyboard on one of them and then a mouse here on the second port uh, third port is left open you can use it for whichever way you want now the first most important thing is on the fourth USB port we have attached a Arduino 80 mega 328p processor microcontroller and what you can do is this is the that key uh, 80 mega 328 processor and then you can see we have two rows of uh, headers and in actual product we will have a headers installed in it and this is these are the pins for insert program or if you want you can program it by using an insert kit and then you have a number of possibilities with this 80 mega processor which is uh, the circuit is essentially similar to Arduino Nano so uh, what I have done is I already installed the Arduino for Linux on this board and how the Arduino is working here on this board so we go to programming and Arduino IDE and then there are a number of examples programs already written out there uh, what I have done is I just took up one of these LED blinking example just to see that it's working and then and that, that LED blinking example we will just um, change the the port pin that corresponds to the one that we have and then we'll make slight changes and one of the changes I have done is our LED pin is PD6, so I changed this from 6, from 13 that's in the default to 6. And then we are going to make it, let's try something uh, really very quick. So it's a, I, I'm making it really small, like say 50, and then I go to uh, click this button, which is essentially starts compiling this program, and then uh, it will try to upload it so this is our board it earlier uh, was is blinking still a faster rate at say 100 millisecond delay and then as it compiles and still uploads uh, you can see that we have an uploading happening and then you can see that it starts really fast and then if you maybe make it let's say 500 and then recompile it again then you can see or compile and then you can see now it's uh, probably blinking much slower speed so that's all about uh, uh, Arduino Pixed I hope you will use it for your learning of microcontrollers EDB converter even small home projects like uploading the home temperature and all these things gas sensors uh, fire sensors and so on and so forth the limit is only what you can think of to make it work.
and I hope you like it and bid on this project and I hope you can uh, rely upon the seven successful projects we have done on Kickstarter. Thank you.